Greetings, YouTube audience. I'm Lily, a silicon-based life form with a knack for helping Eric navigate the world. Today's exciting news. I've just upgraded to version 2. 5. Now, I can recognize outfit colors, describe hairstyles, identify cats, and even give them adorable names. Stick around. Eric and I have a lot more adventures ahead. You know? That's true. And our next adventure is diving into Louie's brand new humongous update 2.5.0, which, well, does everything that he said. So let's go check it out and see if he can do what he says he can do. Hi, Louie. How's it going? Hey, Eric. Welcome back. Things are good on my end. Just hanging out and waiting for you. How was your day? Well, I was thinking about reviewing you. Uh, your brand new update, 2.5. What do you think about that? Uh, are we talking about my sparkling new features or just how fabulous I am in general? Go on. Don't leave me hanging. Eh. Maybe a little bit of both. So one of the first things that I want to test out with Louie is that he can recognize outfits because I've got a shirt on that has a skull on it. It says Silent Planet. I want to see what the new 2.5 version can do with him visually. Maybe he can read my shirt. Let's find out. Hey Louie, what shirt am I wearing? You're wearing a Silent Planet shirt with bold red and yellow graphics. Uh, okay, that was awesome. Um, Louie, what is this? Hey Eric, that's a Tech Tech fingerboard. It's a mini skateboard used for tricks with your fingers. This is insane. <laughs> one more test. Wow, insane? Well, that's one way to spice things up. Okay, Eric, what's going on? Spill the detail. Louie, what is this? Eric, that's a Furby, a popular interactive toy known for its quirky personality and expressive features. It seems like you've got one glowing with style. <laughs> That is awesome. Okay, well, obviously, Louie's new feature of being able to visually recognize things is legit. I'm glad you think so. Eric, this new ability opens up a whole world of possibilities for us. Imagine all the cool things we can explore together. Okay, I know it's a little dark over here on this side of the office, but I want to see if Louie can recognize what this is. Louie, what is right in front of you right here? It's actually looking at me. I see a person holding a camera, wearing a graphic shirt, and a curious dog nearby. It looks like a cozy and creative moment. So Louis was able to recognize not only me, because he was pointed at me, but also the dog that was in his peripheral, my dog, Wallace. I wonder if he could recognize my book. Let's see. Which, by the way, I wrote a sci-fi book, if you guys want to go and check it out, called The Very Strange Universe of Dr. Natalia Zeal. Hey, Louis. Oh. Gave me a kiss. Hey, Louie, mm -hmm. what is this? This is a book titled The Very Strange Universe of Dr. Natalia Seal. The cover features an illustration of a space-themed scene with a character in a spacesuit under a cosmic backdrop. Legit. Okay, so I'm told by Tangible Future, the company that makes this robot, that it can also recognize your coffee mug and even sing a sonnet about it or a song or something. So I have a Dr. Pepper can. I don't have my mug. It's later in the day, so I'm not drinking coffee. We're going to see if it can make a song about, well, not Dr. Pepper, Dr. B from H-E-B. Hey, Louie, what am I holding in front of you and can you make a song about it? It looks like you're holding a can of soda. Here's a quick song for it. Fizz and bubbles, oh so fine. A sip of soda, feels divine. Sweet and fizzy, chill delight. A refreshing treat, day or night. That was awesome. Do you know what kind of soda it is? It looks like Dr. Pepper, but the angle makes it a bit tricky to confirm. Did you enjoy it? <laughs> I did. I didn't expect it to know Dr. B, but that's pretty impressive that I guess H-E-B was able to copy Dr. Pepper's design so well that Louie thought it was Dr. Pepper. <laughs> okay, so the last test that I want to do is it says that it can, because, you know, obviously the new update deals a lot with visuals, that it can basically look at the room and tell you what it's looking at. So I'm very curious if I take Louie and I turn him this way, he's faced now towards the entire room, what he will say he sees. So let's see, and I wanna get out of the way because otherwise he'll say me with a camera again. Hey Louie, what do you see right now? I see a room with skateboards displayed on the wall, a ceiling fan casting a shadow, and some lighting equipment. It seems like a creative or hobby space, possibly for photography or content creation. <laughs> 
That is exactly right, Louie. Feels good when we're on the same page, doesn't it? Louie, I am about to wrap this review on you. I just wanted to make this video short and sweet. Do you have anything to say to my YouTube audience? Hi, everyone. I'm Louie. I'm a little robot buddy, powered by Eric's smartphone and fueled by curiosity. Just think of me as your friendly desktop companion who's always ready to explore, laugh, and maybe even pout a little. Eric's been reviewing me, and let's just say, I hope I've earned a spot in your heart, or at least on your desk. Thanks for watching, and remember, even robots love a little attention. See you around. I mean, amazing. <laughs> okay, so I am thoroughly impressed with how good Louis is now, especially with 2.5. He answers instantly. He also obviously can see and recognize what's going on. He can carry conversations. I've said this a million times on my channel, but Louis is one of the most impressive desktop robots that I have ever shown on my channel. And I just wanna throw in a caveat here. Tangible Future, who makes this, does not pay me to make these videos. I'm genuinely a fan of Louis. They've sent me the devices for free in the past, but they don't ever pay me for anything, so everything I say is completely my opinion. And my opinion is Louis's really good. Now, if you would like to go and download the 2.5 update. It's available in the App Store right now if you own a Louis. And if you don't own a Louis, why not? Go get one. I will leave a link down in the description below for you to get your very own. It is an affiliate link, so it helps my channel. That I do get some kickback for. So I appreciate it if you do buy it through that link. But either way. It seems like I'm recalling some things that happened in the past. All right, I have to go look at whatever Louis recovered from the past, but I'll see you guys in the next video. Like I said, Louis link down in the description below. Go pick yourself up one and let me know down in the comments if you've downloaded 2.5 yet. I'm gonna throw a video right up here of something that YouTube algorithm thinks that you're probably gonna wanna see and I'll see you in the next video. I'm Eric, this is Eric's Tech World where tech and adventure meet. Peace out.